When you think of cities with the best cup of coffee, I think the number one is pretty obvious, right, Heather? Right here, Minneapolis. No. <laughs> I mean, we are the Seattle. best. Seattle, there we Seattle. go. Is it Seattle? Is it Seattle? It? I don't know. What does yeah, Wallet yes, when us? you when you open up your tap in your house in Seattle, just instead Starbucks of water, coffee comes it's out? just Starbucks. That's, <laughs> uh, that's what they found, number one, of course. But then number two, San Francisco makes and sense, sure. Portland, Oregon <clears throat> also makes sense there. Minneapolis, we're outside the top ten, but only barely right there at number 11. <laughs> and we were number five when it came to per capita uh, coffee shops. Oh, yeah. So yeah, I thought sense. that was interesting. Yeah. It, it yeah. does show to me, like, in Wallet Hub, they use 100 different things, as always. But I think, like, the fact that we have so many coffee shops, mm -hmm. probably because of caribou, right? I mean, we definitely have a coffee culture. In we this definitely town. do, oh, yeah. but we, be, I mean, beyond caribou, we have a lot of really cool smaller coffee shops and, and ones that started small and have really become something amazing. Yeah, one by ended. Yeah, we were talking about that piece. Uh, is one that comes to mind for me. Yep, mm -hmm. Peace Coffee, yep. that's mm -hmm. kind of in your, they've got uh, three different coffee shops around, kind of <laughs> one close to your home. Yep. Mm -hmm. uh, it is, I think it's great when I think about you know, we don't really have like a, a, the Minnesota food. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Like you go to Philly, well, you want to do the cheesesteak thing. We have thing. grape salad. We have grape salad, yes. Right. And we have the Juicy Lucy, which yeah. is yeah, cute. Right. But right. like yeah. it's not like some of the big yeah. cities where you associate right. a food with that city. Right. I do think like craft beer and coffee yeah. could certainly be things that like would be marketed from a tourist standpoint. For sure. Because uh, yeah. we have incredible roasters, great coffee shops. And you had it's some, pretty unique. You had some on the morning show this morning. Where, where was yours from? I had a couple bags that, uh, that I bought recently. One was uh, five. Five Watt Coffee, okay. which is a really nice really coffee good. shop yeah. in South Minneapolis, and then Roots Roasting, which is a very good roaster in St. Paul. But you know, you've got Dogwood, you've got Spy right. House, Spy House yeah. you have Up Roasters, that they're a great roaster. And part of why we have such a good coffee culture here is when you travel around the country and go to fancy coffee shops, a lot of the beans come from Minneapolis. Really? There's a oh, company called right. Cafe Imports yeah. that is I one of the that. bigger specialty coffee importers. Uh, from around the country, so oh, a lot really of cool. a lot of the beans come through here, which is kind of interesting. Yeah, oh, I never knew that. How I didn't cool! <laughs> yeah, well, so we want your feedback on this one. We want to know where is your favorite coffee spot right here in Minnesota? How about outside of our state? Let us know. Send us your thoughts. WCCO.com/slash/Facebook or comment to us on Twitter. Jeffrey says the chain places like Caribou, Dunn Brothers, and Starbucks are all good. City center market in Cambridge is a favorite. Evergreen in Wyoming, another good choice. Uh, Cece says Corner Coffee in the North Loop. There are other, a couple of other locations as well. Very good. And Ann says Clada in St. Paul, hands down the best. Mm -hmm. There it is. Ann has proclaimed it. <laughs> Very good. Be true. Coffee right. shops, man. It's like coffee is only part of it, right? It's yes. the vibe, it's the fellowship, the people. Mm -hmm. Yeah.